So here we've got two lovely fillets from this fish, each about, I would say, eight or nine ounces. Perfect portion size. So what I do is use a fork to hold down the tail end of the fish and then run the fillet knife horizontally down close to the cutting board and off presto comes the skin, just like that. The next part is the cool part about preparing the fillets actually to go into the oven. And what we're going to do today is actually use a recipe that I've used in the past for halibut up in Alaska. Another beautiful, fine white meat fish. Very delicate, doesn't need much cooking like the hogfish. So I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of juice over them, these lovely fillets, just to give them a little zing. Takes a sort of rawness out of it. And then I'm going to add just a little bit of all-purpose seasoning. This is a very, very light uh, flavored fish, so you don't want to overburden it with any kind of heavy seasoning or heavy pepper. It's, it just kills the wonderful, subtle flavor of this fish, and that's plenty right there. And I'm going to just moisten them up. And this recipe calls for dipping the fillets into mayonnaise of all things, a thin coating, and then putting those fillets onto crushed Lay's original chips. A really cool recipe. Then we're going to pop them into the oven. We're not going to fry these. We're going to put them into a, a little broiler and it's going to be really quick. So just a quick dip in the mayo. I know a lot of people don't like mayo, but it, you can use uh, cooking oil as well or egg or um, any kind of batter. And then into the Lay's they go. A thin layer of nice crumbs on top and line them up ready to go for the oven.